this is Vlogmas day one. It's the first video that I'm doing. I'm obviously pre-filming this one because you know what I'm like. I'm not good at scheduling or anything like that. So today I thought I would show you what's in my boys December boxes. Now December boxes, I'm not saying I made it up, but it's not something that I've ever really seen before or heard of. And what they basically are are just boxes that I give the boys on the 1st of December to kind of prepare them and I don't know, just like fun things to do in the build up for Christmas. Now we are doing a Christmas Eve box, but the whole reason that I'm doing the December boxes is because I just thought when you do a Christmas Eve box, if you give them any activities or books or clothes, things like that, they're only gonna use them for one night because then the next day is Christmas day, they're gonna get all new stuff and a lot of stuff that goes in a Christmas Eve box I think is good just for Christmas Eve. Then there are some things that you kind of wanna give them earlier, which you could just give them earlier, but I kind of, Basically, I went into Crabtree and in Evelyn back in August and I bought something and they gave me three Christmassy tins and I was trying to think of something that I could use these three boxes for. That's basically it, that's my excuse. So, I will show you what's in the boys' boxes. If you don't know, I have three boys. Reese, my stepson, is three and a half. Jasper, my son, is two and a half. And then my other son, Jensen, is 14 weeks old. So when I was looking at our old Christmas stuff just to see if there was anything I could put in them, like books and just stuff that you'll use kind of every year, I found two boxes that my sister-in-law had given the boys last year, just Reese and Jasper because Jensen wasn't here yet. And I just thought they were so lovely. And obviously if you've been watching my videos lately, you'll know that my sister is very, very poorly at the moment. Um, we're not sure if she'll be here at Christmas. So I really want to incorporate her as much as I can into Christmas. So for Reese and Jasper, they have these boxes. And then for Jensen, he's got the one from Crabtree and Evelyn. So this is Reese's box. He's got two books. He's got Santa is coming to Portsmouth because Reese is from Portsmouth. <laughs> and then the Christmas bear, I lift the flat book. So this is from the illustrators of the Gruffalo. And yeah, it's just a nice little, little storybook. He has then got a Christmassy straw. I picked this up from Next yesterday. It's five pounds. It's got Santa on it, but it's one that it has flashing LED lights and it plays like a Christmas message. I don't know what it is, but as they sip a drink through it, it plays a little message. So I thought that could be fun just to have in there hot chocolate and any other drinks we have in the build up to Christmas. This little top, which was from Next. We got this last year and I think it, oh no, it doesn't light up. It just has a nice like feely, snowman nose. I've then got two little toys. So this one I got from I think a garden centre last year. It's just a little reindeer and it buckles. And then this little one, which is actually from a cracker. It's just like a little push along Santa in a sleigh. And lastly, a little decoration. So it's a little grey star and it says Reese. This was really kindly made from us from an Instagram shop. I'm going to link everything below, like all the names of companies and stuff. And I thought it'd be really nice to go on the tree or go up in their room now. I can let the boys decide where to put it. But it's the kind of thing that they can then have up all year round. It's not too festive. It's just, you know, grey's very in all year round. And then I've just added a little bell just to make it a little bit more Christmassy. So that's everything in Reese's one, and now I'll show you Jasper's. So Jasper's is basically the same, but there are a couple of bits in here that, because Reese is only with us at the weekends, it works out that he won't be with us on the 1st of December. So there are a couple of bits here that I want, like Jasper to put up or start using on the 1st, so I've just put in his box. So he's got the same again, the Christmassy straw and the decoration, the little star, which says Jasper. And then he's also got a little Santa on a sleigh. And then his other toy is a little wind-up Santa that just walks along. Again, that's just from a cracker. And then he also has two books. So he has Santa is coming to Southampton because we live in Southampton. And the snowman and the snow dog. I think this came in like an activity pack last year. And he also has a little top from Next. I think this is one that flashes. <laughs> Might have run out of batteries. But yeah, again, just a little snowman, but a red one. And then a couple of bits to start using from the 1st of December. So this little thing here that says sleep till Christmas, so at the moment there are 91 apparently. I don't actually know how many there are, but yeah, you can just change the little cubes so there's like a countdown to Christmas. And lastly, I got this, which is just little Christmassy pegs and the ribbon, and I thought the boys could put it up in their room and they can hang up any of their Christmas cards from the little friends. Something that I'd rather was in their room rather than like downstairs and like adult space. And then lastly we have Jensen's box. So this is in one of the Crabtree and Evelyn tins. He's got a couple of things the same as the other boys and then some more like baby things. So he has got a couple of books. We've got That's Not My Reindeer and If I Were a Penguin. And these are both Jasper and Reese's from like the last couple of years. So again, little hand-me-downs. And then he's got some little baby leggings. Upside down, and these are from Zoom Baby, and they're really, really cute. And then there's a matching bib as well. And he's also got these leggings from Blade and Rose because I feel like I can dress him Christmassy like 
throughout the whole of December, whereas Jasper I feel like will be a bit fussy and he'll only let me do it every so often. And then these little PJs, I don't actually know if they're PJs or not, but these are just from M&S and they've got a nice like fair old print in cream and grey. And then he has the same Christmas decoration with his name on. This little jelly cat reindeer and it's nice and fluffy and yeah, he's just, he's getting into like teddies and toys and stuff now. So I thought it'd be a nice little, little one for him to have out every Christmas. And then lastly, I got this from Not On The High Street. It's from a brand called Fox's Belts and it's a little Christmas teether. He has been teething for about a month now. He's so dribbly. Yeah, I thought a little safe silicone teether would be perfect. And the fact that it's Christmassy as well is lovely. And I think they do this in red and gold as well. So that's everything. Those are the boys' December boxes. We have a little activity advent calendar, which I've done a video for, so I'll link that below. Basically every day they have like an activity to do, like, I don't know, drinking hot chocolate or making a sofa den or visiting Father Christmas. And day one will be a scavenger hunt. I have little clues like, I don't know, where do you keep your clothes? And then there'll be a clue in the wardrobe and then where does mummy sleep? And then on my bed, they'll have their December boxes and their elf on the shelf. It's the first year we're doing it. I'm really, really excited. So yeah, I think she'll have brought the December boxes for them. I think that's how we're kind of going to do it. Well, I hope you liked it. If you're doing a December box, let me know. If you know you haven't started doing one yet, but you're thinking of doing it, maybe this year or next. I know it's already the first, so it might be a bit too late now, but maybe next year. Thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to give it a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Click the notification bell so you get notifications straight to your phone when I upload. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye!